Alrighty, you guys, we're back to listen to a song by Paul McCartney and Wings um, called Live and Let Die. Um, we're just going to go ahead and get into it, but before we get the video started, please smack the like button and subscribe button. Also, let me know some more stuff that you guys would like to see us listen to. And um, here we go. When you were young and your heart was an open book, you used to say, Live and Let If this ever-changing world in which we live in makes you give in and cry. Um, I did, I should have said, uh, Paul McCartney, Linda McCartney, his wife, is on, uh, was in, I'm guessing, a member of Wings. I'm not 100% sure. Um, but then there's Henry McCullough on the lead guitar. Denny Lane with the backing and bass, backing vocals and bass guitar. Denny Saywell on the drums. Ray Cooper on the percussions. And, uh, yep, that's pretty much it. Of course, Paul is singing and he played the piano. And his wife is, uh, of course, also the backing vocals and played the keyboard. Say, live and let die. Well, first things first, the horns, I guess that's what I'm going to call them with. When he switched to the, when he live and let die, I'm calling those horns. I'm not 100% sure what they were, but man, that was amazing. I like, I got to find out what though, if those are actually horns, but whatever they were, definitely caught me off guard in a good way. You know what this sounds like to me? It's like one of those um, old, like, uh, superhero theme songs that you see in, like, the old cartoons. You know, the way that it's going like this, like, and it's how it's, like, intriguing is going. There's so many changes, so much stuff happening. I, I think that that's what it reminds me of, like, an old cartoon when they play, like, the theme song. Maybe when, like, some action happens, a fight happens, or, you know, you, you know what I mean. You know, there's like so much going on in this song at, at what I kind of like it you know what I mean it keeps you it keeps you on your heels like you can't ever get too used to hearing expecting one thing because as soon as you do expect to continue hearing it you get caught off with something else which is actually pretty cool You know, I like how when the, I'm calling that a violin, I know that that's a violin. I'm like 90% sure that that's a violin. Um, but how it kind of sounds like the, like he's singing, if you get what I'm saying. Like the, the way that they're playing it over it, it kind of like taking the place of him singing. Um, and he just started playing it, but it kind of does sound like it's, if someone is singing the notes on the violin, like it could be. I hope you guys get what I'm saying. Um, but yeah, kind of like someone singing the notes. But if this ever changing world in which we live in makes you give in and cry, say live and let die. I haven't talked about the lyrics really, but uh, I 
think that it's basically saying, you know, when you're young and ambitious, you say you, you try to live your life. And then by, by this ever-changing world, I just think he means you get older. Like, as you get older and things happen to you, it makes you give in and cry. You say live and let die. So maybe, like, I'm not sure, actually, with the live and let die. Uh, oh, or maybe he's saying... Like you've already lived, and now it's just time to, you know, die. But, uh, yeah, man, let's just finish out the song. Let me know uh, if I was right about the meaning of the song. And I hope you guys did enjoy my reaction to it as much as I like listening to it. Um, please do smack that like button and that subscribe button. Also, let me know some more stuff that you guys would like to see us listen to. And um, other than that, till next time, guys. Peace.